right, here we go. Hey guys, it's Lo backstage live at the 58th annual ACM Awards with Old Dominion. How are you guys doing? Good, Great. how are you? I'm doing good too. Happy to have you over here. Thank you for swinging by for a little bit. Absolutely. Um, we got the No Bad Vibes tour going. How, how, how's it started? Because I know we're, we're working with a little bit of an injury. It's okay. You know? There, has, there hasn't been one bad vibe so far. Good. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's, even, that's, even with that. No, that's what I love to hear. One single bad vibe. That's what I love to hear. Stay positive. You know, that's the mantra. <laughs> <laughs> um, I saw some photos on y'all's Instagram of some signs mm. in Florida. And the, the signs have been coming in like... Yeah, really it's, hot. it's really awesome, man. It, you know, even like the last show, there were so many of them. We kind of changed up the show, and we usually do a little acoustic section, but we just turned it into a request hour and just yeah. grabbing signs. And it's a really fun way to like, really for us to see how deep our fans dig into our catalog. It's, it's awesome. It's fun. What's been your, your favorite one maybe that you've seen or maybe like most clever or They're funny? They're getting really clever. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. cool. Like whoever made that beer can and truck bed sign that had like, it was like three dimensional. There was a beer can like, uh, you know, rolling around inside of a clear case. Yeah, and then the ones... The ones where you they're like, what's behind door number one? Oh, those yeah, yeah, are yeah. those are cool. Where you don't really know what the request okay, is going to be. Like a deal cool. or uh, let's make a deal yeah, kind yeah. of vibe. Yeah, for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Somebody made cool. one where you like spin the wheel and it yeah. gets to a song. It's cool. That's awesome. You know, obviously number one hits are awesome and important, but some of those album cuts are really the songs that resonate yeah. with with fans the most. And because it, and I probably shouldn't say this, but because it doesn't sound like a radio hit, it doesn't get played as often. Right. But usually it's the most, you know, emotional connection or just... Yeah, or like, maybe it does sound like a radio hit, and that's a compliment, too. You know, sure. like, that that's really cool, the fact that I think it's one of the biggest compliments when we do have a crowd full of fans that have dug into the whole thing. Yeah, absolutely. And I Should Have Married You, that's, that's well, our... Well, sorry. Oh, the song. <laughs> Damn it. My Matthew's going to be upset now. <laughs> <laughs> no, the song's been really fun to, yeah. to get out there to the world and play live. It's been awesome. That's great. Well, you guys are awesome. I really appreciate you guys coming by, and I hope you have some fun in Frisco, Texas this thank week. Thank you so much. Uh, yeah, and yeah. We, we love you guys, and, and we love your music. So, thank again, you. thank you. Congratulations on everything. Yeah, thanks yeah, for having thank us. Thank you. Of course. Thanks. We're live at the ACMs on 93Q.